That's correct, people. 75 cents for this outdoor gym here in this awesome little hippie town named Campot. Man, I gotta say, this place is special, guys. Coolest gym, and the best part is that it's only me. And it's not only a gym, actually, it's a hostel. So just below me, I think this is the third or the fourth floor. There's a hostel um, where you can stay long term. There's the people that I think they have single rooms and then they have bunk beds. So we're going to find out the prices. But yeah, it was um, actually if you want the gym for the week, it's four dollars. Oh, I didn't know that. And look for a month is 15. It's a really funky place, guys. Really, really interesting. And they got everything like anything that you need. They even get, they have belts if you need some belts. It's epic. I love this little spot. I'm gonna come work out here almost every day. I think I'm just gonna live here. And they got mirrors, so you can keep yourself accountable, you know? Mm. But the view is pretty sweet as well. Let me see how the zoom is with this little camera. Okay, that's the zoom with the camera. I've never used it before. I'll be curious to see how it looks. But yeah, and over there you can see the mountain. Oh, shit, I almost ate it on that, that dumbbell on the floor. really peaceful here guys really really like this place it's a special place a lot of people said I like camp pot and they were right only thing is that the people that like stuff that are really squeaky clean this is probably not the place for you guys um, it's just because you're outside so it gets dusty what do you expect but yeah overall guys this place is legit and for the people wondering they do have treadmills bam right here treadmill so yeah this is the downstairs of this place but yeah guys just a quick little video to show you guys the little different places where you can actually work out here in Cambodia so it is possible to exercise and travel it's just do you have this discipline you know I haven't been too disciplined recently but finding this place um, and knowing that it's here and that I can live here I might just take a week off and just stay here and travel around camp pod there's a lot of stuff to do guys the guy that owns this ho hostel actually um, he's from Australia but he speaks Spanish very interesting dude and he told me that there's so many waterfalls so many water sports and um, so much outdoor adventure stuff to do here in camp pod so I'm really excited and would most likely stay here for a week um, and just figure out what this place is about because it's one of the most well-known I, I think some people mentioned they didn't like camp pod but Maybe they just don't like to be outdoors. But that's really it, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Christian Rodriguez, bye.